Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. We are on the road to Conquest, New Jersey. But before we get there, we are going to go over the matches that will be taking place and recap just how we have reached this point. Starting off, we have the hottest free agent signing in recent memory as Chris Danger challenges E.C. Wadden in a 2 out of 3 falls match. Danger made his surprise arrival on the first episode of Adrenaline to kick off 2019 where he defeated E.C. Wadden in a highly competitive main event match. Wadden has been enraged ever since, demanding a rematch, and has even used a low blow to gain the upper hand in the last one-on-one -on -one confrontation these two men had. Both Chris Danger and E.C. Wadden are high caliber wrestlers, and a victory here would surely put either man on the collision course to, with a championship opportunity. Next up, we have Nathan Michaels, the Canuckler, taking on Mr. Blackmore, who is surely to have Jackson Hart at ringside. Dating back to last year, Jackson Hart has, long, has had a long-standing rivalry with Nathan Michaels, but has been unable to defeat the Canuck. But as the old adage goes, if you can't beat him, join him. But in this case, Hart has turned it and has spent the last several weeks trying to buy Nathan Michaels services. However, when Nathan refused, Mr. Blackmore has stepped in. Blackmore is a highly dangerous hired gun and should not be taken lightly. To make things even more interesting, if Mr. Blackmore wins their match, then Nathan will join Jackson Hart's little faction. But if Nathan comes out victorious, then Jackson has to spend an entire month as Nathan's assistant. Needless to say, this rivalry has gotten very, very personal. But now on to the first of our championship matches. The longest reigning tag team champions in FTW history is no longer the Bronx Bullies. Will Rao and Shogay Tezuka, the Unbreakable Dragons, will defend their titles against the British Invasion Duke Williams and Samuel Gregory. Currently, the Unbreakable Dragons title reign has reached an unprecedented 542 days as of this recording. But the actions of the British Invasion in recent weeks has given them the upper hand to dethrone them. Will Rao specifically has missed several weeks with a concussion after taking a brain buster on the floor at the expense at the hands sorry, of Duke Williams, leaving Shuge Tezuka to fend for himself. The Dragons are no doubt looking for revenge, but I believe that the Brits may have gotten in there in the heads of the Dragons. They appear as dangerous as ever and would love nothing more than to end the reign of the Dragon. The US Championship has been held by many greats here at FTW. Ryan Reese and Angel Fire will be competing in the main event are but just two who have held that prestigious title. But since his return to full throttle wrestling, Clinton Slate has been on a warpath. He has choked out everyone to step up to him and has looked unbeatable since winning the United States title back in July. But the Bulldog might have met his match when he goes one-on-one -on -one with the monster Klein. Klein has decimated Clinton Slate at every turn, leaving the US champ reeling. A few weeks ago, Klein and Slate got into a brutal backstage brawl that saw Slate get slammed repeatedly against the wall. As such, Slate has demanded this title match be no disqualification. That means that nothing, nothing is safe. The FTW Women's Champion is up for grabs as Rain Valentine challenges the champion Claire Gagne. Several weeks ago, Rain demanded a title shot, making the true claim that she has beaten several top stars here in Full Throttle Wrestling, including champion Claire Gagne, but has never received a title shot. After defeating former women's champion Brooklyn in a hardcore match, Rain earned her title opportunity and the champion is, has not backed down in the slightest. Rain did gain the advantage last week when she attacked Claire from behind after her match, but the champ has seemed unfazed and is going to prove why she is the FTW Women's Champion. It is the sheer brawling style of Rain taking on the techno prowess of Claire and what is sure to be a match for the ages. Lastly, and what is to be our main event of the evening, the FTW Championship is on the line as Ryan Reese defends the title against Angel Fire. Fire won the opportunity to challenge for the strap when he was victorious 
in the Conquest Savage Warfare Battle Royal and has been a pain in the ass of our champion Ryan Reese since the beginning of 2019. He has battered and bruised the champion with a steel chair and has hit him with the FKO on the floor and has even hired a business manager so, th so that he himself would not have to be in the building. His business manager, Amber King, who is lovely by the way, has made the bold statement that her client will be victorious and claim the FTW Championship. But if there's one thing we have learned over the years is that Ryan Reese is, isn't defeated so easily. Whenever Reese gets knocked down, he always tends to get back up no matter what happens. And now he has promised to give Angel Fire the beating of a lifetime. Reese may not be 100% going into their match, but he is surely going to give his all because that's just the kind of man that Ryan Reese is. This has all the potential to be the match for the night, and one that I personally cannot wait to see. And there we go, ladies and gentlemen. That is all the matches scheduled to take place at Conquest New Jersey. Remember to like, share, and subscribe, and I will see you all in New Jersey.